Okay, I'd like to draw your attention to an article um, published in the Journal of Clinical Microbiology, published by the American Society for Microbiology. Uh, and its title is RNAs resistant virus like particles containing long chimeric RNA sequences produced by two plasmid co expression system. Wow, quite a mouthful. Now, what is stands out to me in this article, um, if we come down here, it mentions the severe acute respiratory syndrome coronavirus. Now, this is fair enough, because if we search for SARS-CoV-1, Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome Coronavirus, SARS-CoV or SARS-CoV-1, 16th of April 2003, outbreak of SARS in Asia. Okay, so this is 2003. Now, that makes sense. What doesn't make sense here is SARS-CoV-2, which, if we have a look at this, we should all by now know that this only came to light in 2019. The virus shows little genetic diversity, indicating that the spillover event introducing SARS-CoV-2 to humans is likely to have occurred in late 2019. We should all be familiar with that. Now, back to this article. Journal of Clinical Microbiology, they're talking about it here. SARS-CoV-2, when was this? If we come down here, footnotes. Received 20th of November 2007. Returned for modification 28th of December 2007. Accepted 16th of February 2008. Copyright 2008 American Society for Microbiology. So I'd love to hear from anyone who can give me some um, insight as to what the hell the SARS-CoV-2, which supposedly only appeared in 2019, what it's doing in this paper by the Journal of Clinical Microbiology, published by the American Society for Microbiology, in 2008, 2007, 2008. And what's more, what the hell is this? SARS-CoV-3. What is this? If we have a look for SARS-CoV-3, what do we got? We got nothing. We got no mention of SARS-CoV-3. We're only on SARS-CoV-2, which is the 2019 coronavirus. So what is SARS-CoV-3? Have they already got the next pandemic lined up for us? So if anybody has any insight into this very strange paper in the Journal of Clinical Microbiology referencing SARS-CoV-2 back in 2007, uh, please leave a comment below and perhaps together we can figure out what's going on here.